Okay, last time in the club we were using these kind of motors and these kind of wheels. Okay, I want to now tell you a little more about this one, which you have uh, you have seen already. I think I showed showed it to you. This was made a couple of years ago by my son, and you see the joints are you know really just he used to twist the wires like this. It's not done very nicely, but it still works even after many years and i remember we sat and painted this nicely in green color to give it a military tank look and here you see there is this tape because uh, his idea was that this should really look like a tin tank with a with a chain so i'll tell you a little bit more about this but first let let's see whether it really functions okay and for comparison you can see the wheel sizes are almost the same but it's a different wheel i'll take it out and show you and i'll also show you the motor that this is not this one but something else okay first let me connect the battery okay difficult with one hand okay so i will just connect it uh, like this so I've connected here he made a hole so that I can put it in this and then there is a switch at the back see so now I'll switch it on and hopefully it will work okay it works It's working nicely. Now let's see how this is made. I want to pause it here. Okay, now let's look below this. I'm always worried about destroying this. Uh, let's see. Okay, here. You see this this um, this black frame that you see. That's a metal chassis. We have just painted it green on the top, but there's the metal chassis that you'll find probably for 100 or 200 rupees. I don't remember. Okay. Now you see these two ones, the back two wheels have motors. Okay. And these are clearly different from this one. That's very different. Okay. And RPM is also very low because you saw that it was going very slowly. Also, the front two wheels, they don't have motors, okay? Now, these, uh, these white circles that you see here, these are called dummies. Okay, that's a dummy. I'll open it and show it to you. I hope I can do it holding a camera in one hand. Um, let's try. So, here, you see this, this is a dummy one. So I will remove this uh, this wheel. Okay, and I'll just pull it out. Okay. So that's the wheel. This is nice it has some I don't know how to call this but it provides good friction and then you see this is what I was saying that this is the dummy um, here okay this part so I'll pull this one also out so, okay, I have to use my feet now um, here I will just You see this is what was 
used to tighten it it's a plastic um, plastic bolt i think uh, nut and bolt okay one of these i am <laughs> i don't know whether you call it a nut or a bolt but whatever you call it and this, this thing you and now just remove it like this so it comes off okay so that's how you have to put in the chassis so you push it from here okay and then you on this thread on this plastic thread you tighten this then you put the wheel push it then remember you had this screw and then you put it there which i will not do now and of course uh, how you beautify it's up to you okay so we also left a brown patch here this is made out of cardboard so we left a brown patch so that it really looks like you know, the way military puts it so that's something you can you can make easily